Okay, class. Welcome to week number two. <clears throat> and excuse me, I'm a little uh, sick, so if I sound a little froggy or sound a little froggy, uh, bear with me. Uh, so we are going to go ahead and start this pre-recorded session. Just want to give you a follow-up and update on week one. You should have all your assignments in by Sunday midnight, which is uh, today. So make sure you have your assignments in by Sunday midnight. If you have an issue with that, go ahead and email me directly so I could go ahead and uh, work with you in getting those assignments in in a timely manner. So for week two, we want to go ahead and do an overview of week two. Uh, but before we begin, uh, this week for your discussions, you're going, you're going to need to know who your partners are. Uh, one of your discussion boards requires you to provide feedback to your assigned partner. So I'm going to go ahead and show you who your partners will be. So if you look at that there, uh, these are your partners. I put your last names on the uh, table here. So. Annalise will be paired up with Norman. Bay would be paired up with Palacios. And you could figure that out, you know, so on and so forth. So Bryn would be paired up with Pet. Carlos with Reed. So go ahead and make sure that you know who your partners are. Go ahead and connect with them and uh, provide constructive feedback to each uh, of your videos that you will be creating from here on out. If you have any issues as far as, um, you know, your partner's not communicating with you or there's a, you know, lack of, of participation on one of your, one of your uh, part, assigned partners, go ahead and let me know so I could go ahead and intervene and see what might be the issue. But I've never had an issue with this, so go ahead and uh, reach out to your partners and make sure that you provide a link to your partner so they could provide constructive feedback on your video. And again, if you have any questions, feel free to email me so I could go ahead and address those questions. Now, an overview of week number two. So for week two, this is where you'll be starting to record your first video. Again, all assignments are due by Sunday midnight. I would not recommend that you record on Sunday uh, midnight because there's situations that come up, uh, a lot of technical situations that I've uh, experienced in the past with students. So please make sure that you are not waiting till the last minute to do your recordings. <clears throat> so Week two, though, there's some readings there to do. You'll have your lecture eight outline, so I recommend that you look at that before you do your readings. And then you'll go ahead and look at the overview of the chapters. And then there's your PowerPoint lecture there for chapters four and five. And then you have lecture B for chapter six and chapter seven and eight. And then there's that PowerPoint that goes with those chapters there. So go ahead and, uh, you know, look through those readings. Uh, you might want to skim through them and should not focus a lot on, on knowing all the details, uh, more focusing on the big ideas, main themes that you see in the chapters. And then, <clears throat> you'll have your week two learning activity. Uh, this would be your group counseling video where you will look at the video, submit your reflection here, and, and submit that for your points for this assignment. Again, you'll have your discussion boards. The discussion boards for this week, there will be two. And for week two, discussion board two, this is where you would provide feedback to your partner. Again, you know who your partners are. So go ahead and 
email them and make sure that they have your video link so they could go ahead and provide feedback. Okay, so moving along, then you'll have your reflections of the chapters, <clears throat> which here you will do your reflection for chapters four and five, and then chapters six and seven, okay? Now, this is where you want to really play, pay close attention to the template, okay? What I would do is I would just copy and paste onto a Word document and then upload your template. This is your lesson plan. And here, you know, you want to put the group title, uh, whatever you want to title your group, the session, the grade level that you're working with, the time that you started and ended, and the purpose of the group. So if it's for anxiety, eating disorders, you want to write that there. And then you want to uh, look at the American School Counselor National uh, Standards and tie it to a standard that you are addressing within your group. You could go ahead and write that on here and be done with that part there. If you will be including any materials, for example, any posters, poster paper, markers, you know, uh, vision boards, whatever you're going to be including, go ahead and include here. And so <clears throat> the session assessment, uh, are you going to be doing a little survey at the end? Are you going to be just kind of asking your, your group how they felt by giving, you know, a thumbs up, thumbs down? Like what, what, what type of assessment are you going to be using during your, your group session? And so any essential questions that you will be asking, any hook that you'll start with, and then uh, procedures. So are you going to state the rules of confidentiality? Are you going to state the, the norming rules for a group? So on and so forth. Okay. So <clears throat> make sure that you're filling out this template and you submit it to the link here. Okay. And then you'll have your quizzes and essay format and then your quiz and multiple choice format. Okay. Again, the quizzes for the essays, I've been asked, does it have to be an essay? They don't have to be an essay. They could be two paragraphs um, maximum. Don't, don't make it more than that. <clears throat> okay. Now your video. So here, as we've been mentioning since, since week one, you want to create a video, 10 to 15 minutes, and make sure that if you are using students or even adults, um, even if they're friends, you need to get consent. The consent forms are under course resources. You go here. Uh, where is it? At? Where are they at? Right here. Course resources. <coughs> and they're right here. Okay. So parental consent if you're working with a minor and participant consent if you're working with an adult. Okay. So again, make sure that your topic is consistent and the same throughout your three sessions. You also want to make sure that your participants are the same throughout the three sessions. Do it 10 to 15 minutes, no more than 15 minutes. And the rubric as to how I'm going to grade your videos are right here. Okay. The easiest way 
to do your videos so I can view them is through YouTube. So you could upload them to YouTube and make sure that you provide that link when you submit your your um, video. Make sure that you provide the link in the comments section so that I could click on that and know and be directed to your video. Okay. One last piece of advice for your videos is make sure that they're public. Uh, sometimes you make them private and I'm not able to see your videos. So make sure that they are public and that you submit that link to me when you are done with your video. So there you have it. That is week number two. If you have any questions, again, feel free to email me and I will get back to you with any questions that you may have. All right. So that is it for week two. Good luck. And we will see or not see each other. I will uh, provide updates throughout the week and finish grading week one. Good luck.